Hey everyone, and welcome to a little side video where I'm basically going to explain to you guys the money-making trick in Story of Seasons, Friends of Mineral Town. So basically with this trick, you can earn about 50 to 60,000 a day pretty easily. And it all revolves around this item, Van's favorite. This is an item you sometimes get in the morning when you wake up in the mail, saying that you won a contest. It does seem random at first, but it's actually pretty easy to get this item every single day, and I'm going to show you how. So the first thing we need to actually explain is the actual mechanics on how to get Van's favorite. Basically the game in the background is secretly keeping track of how many transactions you've done every single day. Or not every single day, but throughout the entire game. And if that number of transactions equals a multiple of 10, and you go to bed, in the morning you'll receive a bottle of Van's favorite. So the only problem is the game doesn't actually tell you how many transactions you've done, but there's a pretty simple way of figuring it out. So the first thing we want to do is A, we need to save. There we go. And next thing we want to do is actually buy something. So when I say transactions, it doesn't matter how many items you buy. What the game keeps track of is that you went into a store, you paid to buy something, and then you exited all the way out. That is one transaction. Oops. Okay, so yeah, that didn't count since I didn't buy anything. But now that we've bought one thing, I'm gonna go to bed. So basically what we're trying to do is we're gonna be adding one to our number of transactions until we reach that magic number where we get a Vance favorite in the morning. So, let's see if we needed just one more item to get to that point. Also, it doesn't matter what you buy. It can be anything. You just need to pay money and exit the conversation. So, the answer is no. I did not get Van's favorite in the morning. That means one was not the magic number. So let's reload our save. And try buying two things this time. So we're going to go into the store, do one transaction, and then we're going to do one more. And then we just keep repeating this pattern until we get a Van's favorite in the morning. So I think that should be enough, actually. I think I did the calculations beforehand. So let's go to bed and find out. Alright, so... That's not it. That's it. So yeah, that means that we now our number of transactions is a multiple of 10. So now we get another Van's favorite. So now that we know that our transactions exactly, not exactly equals 10, but is a multiple of 10, now we can actually manipulate it so that we get one of these every single day. So what we need to do is first off, we need to find a place that's open for me to buy stuff. The supermarket's the earliest, earliest thing that opens, so I'm just going to go wait there until around 9 a.m. So what our goal is right now, you open at 9, right? Yeah. So what our goal is right now is we want to go in there and buy 10 items separately. And then we can go straight to bed. And if I did this right, we're going to get another Vans, or Vans favorite in the morning. And then, yeah, we basically can repeat this every single day until we make as much money as we want. And all we need to do is remember to keep track of how many times we buy items. As long as it's only 10 items, or 20, as long as it's a multiple of 10 items bought per day, we can basically get infinite numbers of Vans Favorite, well, once a day. We can get one Vans Favorite per day, and then sell it for a ton of money, which I'll show off later. Alright, they're going to open in about half an hour. There we go. Alright, so let's see if we can get another one before I go sell these off. So it doesn't matter what I buy, so I'm just going to buy one thing of oil ten times in a row. What I like to do is basically go in here and make sure I, I buy something I'm not carrying. Just so that it's really easy to figure out how many you bought. So I bought three so far, because I have three jugs of oil. So I want to make sure I buy ten. Uh, halfway there. Also, yeah, it doesn't have to be the same item. It just has to be a item. 
All right, two more. And 10. All right, so now that we bought 10 items separate, we did 10 transactions, I'm gonna go back to bed. And if I did this correctly, we'll have another Vans favorite in the morning. Alright, let's go see if we have some mail. And the answer is, yep, there it is. So yeah, we basically got it down that we can get one of these every single morning. But the thing is, how do you make money off these? So, for one thing, you cannot ship Van's favorite. But, if you prefer an uh, Huang over at Zach's house, oops, wrong menu. If you prefer him up to four notes, he'll actually start buying items from you. And he'll buy items that you cannot ship normally. So, I'm gonna reload my save real quick because I already had one there. Let's go try selling one of these. But yeah, basically the key to all this is that you need to have Huang up to uh, four notes of friendship. If he's not buying stuff from you, this is pointless. So what we want to do is sell him Van's favorite. And he'll buy it for about 50000 easily. Also, another thing about him is that you can actually haggle with him, kind of. So if we don't sell it to him and try again, there is a chance that we'll get a better price. Nope, that's a much worse price. We want to get around... Actually, I would have been fine with 55000 But yeah, basically it will range from between... Around like 48000 to... 59000 I believe. Yeah, we're not getting great luck here. I'll try one more time. There we go, that's a pretty good price. But yeah, basically we can do this once a day, and that just made me 56,000 gold for basically the price of 10 bags of feed, which is about 100 gold. So yeah, if we do this every single day, we can just absolutely wreck the economy of Mineral Town. But that's a money-making trick, pretty simple. Anyways, thanks everyone for watching. Bye, guys.